Hi guys, we'll do a quick little video here. Got a, a couple of new pieces in. Right now they're being um, acclimated to the temperature of the tank. And after that, um, figure I'd try out this new drip acclimation um, valve that I have here set up. But, I'll show you what I've got. Um, not sure what the name of this piece is, but it's uh, another little acro. Should be nice. Um, over here, we have a Is that a blue acro? So that's pretty cool looking. Get a better look once I um, get these acclimated and in the tank. And we've got a few hermit crabs as well. But yeah, so we'll be back. Let's let these um, you know sit in the water for another ten minutes or so and get those ready to go inside to start acclimating them for drip acclimating them for the tank okay it's been about 20 minutes from the start well first we'll start with the crabs here the um, hermit crabs we'll stick these guys in this bucket Oh, and by the way, these crows come from uh, Barrier Reef Aquariums, my local aquarium store. Have them shipped in. And it's a pretty reasonable price. Um, since I'm in state, shipping's only 15 bucks. So, that's just pretty cool. And um, actually, um, came with um, quite large pieces, so not a lot bigger than the frags that I'm used to getting from other places, and they look pretty healthy, so I'll open these guys up, you can see here, and camera off the tripod so give you a better look so we take this um, excuse my filming we take this little drip line here stick it in the bag and um, open this valve and it will start to drip hopefully let's see let's um, open that a little bit more Yeah, there we go. So there's the um, first one we're dripping. Um, we'll let that fill up there, and then move on to the next, the next bag. So yeah. I was a little worried because um, I actually wasn't home to pick these up when they showed up today and they had to be signed for and so I had actually had to wait until 4 p.m. and go down to the FedEx place and pick them up but they're doing, seem to be doing okay. Everything looks 
Everything looks good, but as you know, only time will tell. But yeah, so there's the first set. come back when this is done okay now let's see so I don't know if you can see this but um, we've got the crabs all acclimated dump these guys in the tank as we know uh, um, we don't want to um, well the thing about the store that I purchased these things from the um, barrier reef dips um, while well, they dip their fish and their fish are, I mean they dip it for copper so you don't want to put the water in your tank so we have these guys a few hermit crabs guys and now we will move on with the the other two corals okay, um, the two corals are in the tank there you guys can see I'm not too sure about the placement um, these things are going to get big and I'm trying to leave um, enough space for them to grow out the um, Monte Poro though up there, I mean it looks great. We can't really see it, but uh, it will be blue. It's um, not very happy at the moment. I mean, as you can see, there's a little bit of slime from all the handling that it's gone through. And um, like I said, I added my cleanup crew is getting thin, so. I added a few, a few more snails. Put on, I think it's probably about, um, probably about six or seven more. Um, excuse me, crabs that I've um, added to the tank. But yeah, so everything's acclimated, and um, you know, um, done as you know best I could. Um, you know, I know it's risky, I don't have a quarantine tank, but like I said, I've been going to this, getting corals and stuff from barrier reefs, and like I said, they, um, they dip everything in copper and um, treat everything before it goes out, so I'm pretty confident in their abilities, so yeah, you know, let me know what you guys think, um, I'll shoot another video here. Um, in a day or so, um, hopefully the crows will open up and get a little more happy and, um, you know, you'll be able to see their true colors. So, thank you guys for watching. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, um, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.